Hi, this is Glenn, and this is the introduction to the Asteroid tutorial um, created in Houdini. And over the next three videos, you are going to be creating this, basically. Okay, pretty simple stuff, um, but looks quite effective. So over the next three videos, you are going to be learning um, geometry operations, um, particularly uh, well, it'd be quite a lot of um, sock bashing. So we're going to look into using lattice deformers, uh, but we won't be using a shelf tool for that. We'll actually be building that ourselves. So it'll be a custom build. Um, so there'll be that. That shall be projecting geometry onto a secondary geometry with a ray sop. Um, we'll look at very touch base very briefly with particles. Um, there's going to be copy stamping for all the chunks. Uh, you can see the, uh, the the particles here coming off the uh, the front of the asteroid. Um, there's going to be sh shading. Um, uh, all the environment is just a standard um, side effect shader. Uh, the asteroid is a custom built shader from scratch um, from a completely empty um, shop scene. We shall create create what you're looking at there. Um, and on top of that, there will be an appendix video which will briefly touch on compositing, which is also going to be done in Houdini in a compositing editor. Um, so that's bringing in your uh, your different parts here and adding some glows. As you can see, there's a bit of a glow here, and it's a bit of a it's a bit of a blur and a glow on there. Um, with that, there's also be looking into calculating the velocity of geometry objects so we can use uh, that calculation for motion blur and obviously there's going to be the, the rendering in there so with that um, I think that's all I need to uh, need to tell you at this moment in time uh, there's part one part two and then there's an appendix video for the compositing um, so with that I shall pull this to a close I hope you stick with me and see this through to the end and yeah, have fun. Take care.